and you're on. Thank you. Uh, I'll call the meeting to order and we need a roll call vote to do that. And uh, just for advice, Jane, do I uh, read this first or after? Uh, I guess I read it now. Per Governor uh, Baker's order suspending certain provisions of the open meeting law, general law chapter 30A, section 20, the public will not be allowed to physically access this school committee meeting. Members of the public can access the meeting via Montague Community Television broadcast. The extension of, in addition, the extension of the emergency open meeting law provisions were signed into law as chapter 20, section 20 of the acts of 2021. The school committee reserves the right to implement additional remote participation procedures and will notify the public of these procedures as it is practical to do so. Um, and with that, we need a roll call to open the meeting. Uh, and I'll call it off. Jane? Yes. Heather? Yes. Jennifer? Yes. Nick? Yes. Yes. John? Yes. Timmy? Oh, I said yes. Yeah. I thought you said Smith. I said yes before you called John. That's all right. I'm You're in there now. And okay. my and myself. Uh, all right, the meeting is called to order. The first order of business, blah, 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 is the election of a chair whereby I can sit back. Um, first of all, we need to have nominations for that position. Are there any nominations out there? Heather. Sorry, um, thank you. <laughs> I nominate Jane if she accepts. Is there a second? John? I'll second. second that. Okay. Sorry, I'm not used to having to watch for hands up. <clears throat> um, Jane, are you willing to accept this nomination if you, in fact, get voted in? You were muted, Jane. I finally found the mute, and then I didn't need it. <laughs> yes, I will. OK, are there any other uh, nominations to be brought forward? And I can't see everyone, so if someone has one, just speak up and present it. Bill, it's Timmy. Yes, Timmy. I'd like to nominate Heather. Is there a second for that? Nominator for what, sorry? For Heather. Nominate Heather for what? Chair. Oh, okay, I thought we were, sorry. I thought we moved past the, I apologize, thank you. No. Is there a second? Sorry, can I ask a question, like a qualifying question? So right now, anyone can nominate anyone and then it's like you do like a vote kind of thing? Exactly, you got it. You may be in line shortly. <laughs> I will not accept. <laughs> My dance card is full. Um, okay, I don't know. Se this is feels strange because like, if Heather wants it and Jane doesn't, but I don't know that, then I'd be happy to second Heather. But like, I also am not interested in stepping on toes. So this feels like a very weird thing process. Well, first I'll ask Heather if she, if we get a second, would you accept? I would not right now. I really appreciate it, Timmy. And I do want to be chair at some point. I just can't do it with work right now. Um, so I appreciate it, but I, I can't, I just can't accept. And I really appreciate Jane doing it yet again. Okay, thank you for the clarification on the process. I really do appreciate that. Sure. Well, Jen, it's also okay to just go ahead and nominate and then we can get to that. You know, it it's not that strict, so. <laughs> Absent a second, are there any other nominations for chair? And if not, then I'll close the uh, 
nomination. And now I believe it needs to be a roll call vote. I don't think it needs to be a ballot vote, but in any event, I'll go down the list again. Uh, Jane. You're muted. Keep doing that, sorry, I've lost all my skills. Yes. Heather. Yes. This is uh, just to be sure this is a vote to reelect Jane as chairperson. Jennifer. Thank you and yes. Uh, Nick? Yes. John? Yes. Timmy? Yes. And myself? Yes. Uh, thank you all. And Jane, thank you very much for taking control of this meeting from me. All right, if you insist. <laughs> all right. Um, may I ask one question? I'm supposed to be at another meeting right now. Um, do you think there are any issues on the aspects of the agenda that would reflect my thing? I'm just making sure we have a quorum without you. One, two, three. You have a quorum. Six. Yeah, we're okay then. Sure. Um, all right. Sounds good. Then I think I'm going to leave the meeting. I'll wait and I'll wait until you get through the appointments. Okay. Thank, yes. Thanks for your patience. Thank you very much for doing it. Um, next item on the agenda is a election of a vice chair. We'll open the floor to nominations. If Cassie's not here, is it fair to nominate her? She didn't say we couldn't. Then I'll... I'll Think I'll some... nominate her. Okay, thanks, Bill. We have a no... do I hear a second for Kathy second. and Heather? Okay, thank you. I mean, Jennifer, any other nominations for vice chair? Question, John, are you at all interested? It's a really great, there aren't a lot of um, responsibilities, but it, if you do go to the planning meetings, it can be a really great learning experience. I, I, I'm really not qualified for any office yet. I, I really I feel uh, I would like to just uh, get oriented and learn the ropes, but, but thank you. Any other nominations? In that case, we'll close the nominations for vice chair. Does and she have to accept it? She said, yeah. I, well, she can't. I, I don't, I don't know if it's a rule. I don't know if it's a rule that you have to accept the nomination. I didn't see that in the, in the policy. Is that true, Sabrina? That's how I understood it, but I could be wrong. I, I don't know. It it's never. Heather, can you check the information quickly? Maybe Robert's Rules of Order or something? Because that's a great question. I've not, I didn't encounter it in our policy, but that's not necessarily all encompassing. I mean, I have been elected to other things when I wasn't necessarily there, but I don't know how if it's different rules for a school committee. Jane, is there a way to reach out to her and ask her if she'll accept the nomination to move things along? Oh, that's a great idea. Why don't we do that at the same time? I can text her. Thank you. So a quick thing only says, they can decline during the nominating process. Oh, great. It doesn't say you have to say yes, just no. I, ju I don't see that. Okay, I did, I did send her a quick text, see if that's okay.
Yeah, all the rules talk about that they can decline, but there's nothing about them having to accept. It's not a requirement. They can be they can be voted in without oh, accepting. Okay. Yeah, I thought it was odd, but I, I thought that's the way it seemed. So okay, I did text her, but I guess in the meantime, she can always decline later and we'll do this over. Okay, uh, then I'll close nominations and we'll have a roll call vote to appoint, reappoint Cassie as chair. Heather? Yes. Bill? Yes. Jennifer? Yes. Nick? Yes. John? Yes. Timmy? Yes. And myself? Yes. Thank you. Um, next item, we need to appoint a committee secretary. I'll open the floor for nominations. Can I ask what the secretary does in this um, committee? When Sabrina can't be here to take notes, they take notes. Um, have there been other things, Heather? since you've been secretary? I know Mike was for a while, quite a while. Um, in the past year, I've only had to take notes once or twice. And that's all I remember. <laughs> so Sabrina, I think... are, are there any other of your duties that the secretary has to perform sometime or? See, not that I know of, but could I give some to her? I'm afraid <laughs> that's not a question. Now come on. <laughs> Let's not confuse the issue. <laughs> so I, I just have one more point of clarification. I think yeah. the, the chair and the vice chair are nominations and then you appoint them. And I think the other ones are just appointed without it, a nomination. Right. It, it is appointed, but it did say in the thing by the committee. So I think it, I think I'm just thinking of what we did in the past, but right. the, the chair and the vice chair were nominated and had to accept and then appointed. But then after that, I think we just appointed people for the right. rest of the, the, the items. <clears throat> right. And, and I think we certainly can. I just, I think we just got more comfortable if we actually voted it. Um, All right. Maybe that was the whole remote thing. I don't know. I think maybe because we weren't there in person. You could be absolutely right for that. Anything could be right nowadays. I have no idea. All right. Uh, yes, John. Uh, if the duties are restricted to just taking notes on the odd occasion when uh, Sabrina is absent, if we can agree to that. Uh, and I don't know how thorough they would be. Uh, I don't know exactly how specific. I guess I could always refer to the recording. If uh, I, I appreciate so. that. I did think of one more thing though. Heather, when we've been remote, or even not how that, no, I don't know how that's going to continue when we're in person. The secretary has taken on the job of, we've opened it up to the community if they want to communicate with the entire committee that they send the information through Heather, through the secretary, because the public can't send something to the entire committee on their own through email. So the secretary is responsible for taking that information and disseminating it to the full committee. And then if somebody wants to speak at public participation, they also give them the information on where to find the link and that sort of thing. Correct, Heather? Yep, I totally forgot about that. And that do. doesn't happen regularly. And when it does, it's not a big deal. I can let you know what my process is, but it's it's not it's not very labor intensive. Uh, yeah, I would probably need assistance in, in, in that, but uh, you know, that, that doesn't sound too bad. And I presume that when you take notes, you, you just have to have an, a, an entry for each item in the agenda. I, I presume that would be the, the framework for the notes sure. and maybe pad it out from looking at the recording. So, so, uh, so if, if, if secretary's restricted to that, I guess I'll give it a shot. And that would be for when would those duties begin at the next meeting? Yes. I see. Okay. Yes. Okay. Um, okay. Yeah. Sorry. The only other thing that I thought of was um, posting the election warrant before the election, but 
Heather got a free pass because I did it myself. Uh, oh, that's, that's right. Yeah. Yeah. I, I figured she was taking minutes. So I would, I would go post the warrants at the two town halls. So, so what does that mean? You mean physically post the, the yeah, uh, you go what is the, the warrant, the ballot? Or I see, I, I don't even know what these things are. That's how naive I am. John, John you, you signed it. Remember you came into central office and all the committee members had to sign three copies of the election warrant. It's just a public notice that gets posted at the town hall. Oh, I see that we're running for the, yes. for these, for these exactly. positions. Yeah. I, yeah. I see. So, okay. Okay. Yeah, but I have to bring them ballots. So usually I sometimes I'll post the warrant while I'm there. Okay. Anyway. Now you're going to have to give me, you know, heads ups and nudges and kicks to get this done. And if worse comes to worse, I watch the video and do it myself. <laughs> yeah, okay. Uh, all, all right. So, uh, Sabrina, when, uh, so are, are you going to be, so I, I would actually take notes in your absence and then those other duties. Uh, and I'm presuming though that these duties are enumerated in some documents somewhere uh, that I could look at. Yes, yeah, so I'm, I'm a very good teacher and I give plenty of heads up, right, Heather? <laughs> okay, that's Sabrina talking, is that correct? Yes, or, yep, okay. sorry. Yep. All right. it's my, true. Connection's <laughs> better. my connection's better without video. Okay, okay, uh, okay. Yeah. Uh, all right, so uh, I, I can just come down, knock on the office too if I need help, all right? I can. Yep. And you can, it's okay to reach out to a school committee member. If we're not talking about business, we, you're more than welcome to ask for one of us for help in, in doing something. And that's yeah. totally, yeah. Okay. And we're happy to. Okay. All right. Well, I guess I'll nominate myself then for uh, secretary. You, well, I'll, I'll nominate you. I'll be happy. Oh, okay. 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 I think he can nominate himself, actually. I think you can second yeah. that, right? Yeah. And I'll be the second. We're all good. Yeah. <clears throat> Any other nominations for secret committee secretary? Okay, I'll close the nominations. We'll have a roll call vote. Heather? Yes, thank you, John. Yes, thank you. Bill? Yes. Jennifer? Yes. Nick? Yes. John? Yes. Timmy? Yes. And me, yes, thank you. Thanks, John. All right, next item, we, we need to appoint the district financial officers. The first one being the treasurer. The treasurer is not a member of the school committee. At the present time, it's Cynthia Caparasso. I hope I pronounced that correctly. So I would entertain, we need to appoint her, I don't, Again, I'm not sure if we have to vote it or not, but let's just do it. I think it feels better if we all weigh in. So um, I will nominate Cynthia as treasurer. Second. And Heather will second. And we'll have a roll call vote. Hers is a, as I say, is not a member of the committee. We have a an assistant treasurer who's a member. Um, Cynthia is someone that we employ to do a very good job doing the treasury for us. Um, in favor, Heather? Yes. Bill? Yes. Jennifer? Yes. Nick? Yes. John? Yes. Timmy? Yes. And myself? Yes, thank you. And we also need an assistant treasurer. Jane, two things. Um, one is I totally forgot, and we can also, it, you're welcome to pass it off, but isn't the, uh, no, that's the vice. Never mind, ignore me. Pretend I didn't say that, but I'll be happy. I'm getting bonded, so I'll just nominate myself for. <laughs> oh yeah, that's the, that's the deal about mm. being assistant treasurer. You have to be bonded and that's a process. And once you're there, that's very good of you. Thank you, Heather will nominate herself and I'll second that. Any other nominations for that position? In that case, I'll close nominations. We'll take a roll call vote. Heather? Yes. Bill? Yep. Jennifer? Yes. Nick? Yes. John? Yes. Timmy? Yes. And me, yes. Thank you. 
Um, the only other item on the agenda tonight is reappointment of subcommittees. Um, we can go through them tonight if that's the wish of the group. Um, or I'll we do whatever. <clears throat> I'll serve on whichever ones you want, but I'm leaving now. Well, that's okay. what I was. Yeah, and that's great. Thanks, Bill. Yeah. Bye bye. Um, that was. I've lost everyone. Is it? Yeah, no. Can they I, hear me? My, my connection. Yeah, my connection is horrible, and I try to. It doesn't always tell me till I've been like blank for a while. Then it tells me what it's doing. Sorry about that. It's not That's like okay. weather tonight. Um, most of the committees, uh, we still have the same members because everyone who was on the committees, they're pretty much um, back, fortunately. But if it's acceptable, we we'll, we can go back through um, the details and see if there's anyone who would like to switch to a different committee or anything like that at our next meeting, if that's acceptable. Sounds okay. great. People feeling okay about that? Any? Let's put it this way: anybody uh, have an objection? Okay, so we'll put that on the next list. And it looks like we have. Looks like Sabrina's got her hand up. Oh, okay. I oh, I couldn't see it. Yes, thank you, Sabrina. Thank you. I just I thought I should clarify for Nick that um, his write-in was for a Montague two-year term. Okay, I just wanted you to to understand that before. I probably should have said that earlier, but I didn't know if I missed something trying to get onto the meeting. Right, okay. and thank you, because I don't know if I included that in the text asking. You did, yeah, you told me. Sometimes okay. I do and sometimes I don't, but thank you. We're all on the same page, thank you. It's, just, it's been a long, long day. I just- I'm just. i only on for a year, right? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Heather, now you stop. Yours was a three-year term and we're very happy. Thank you very much. Welcome back for a long time. Okay. Although John's, John's is a one year. John's is a one year, but we certainly feel that by the next time we can, you know, make him motivated to go for a three year term because he will just miss it so much if he doesn't. <laughs> yes, thank you all for running and, and coming back. Um, I didn't run. I know, but you know, see, Nick, you can even you know the feeling, it. Nick. <laughs> like the Hotel California. Yeah, people can relate to that. Yeah. I, I, I waited till the last day. I was hoping someone else would file papers, but nobody did. No, I, I think it's a tough time for, you know, committees. And I really appreciate everybody being willing to serve and, and do the work. I appreciate that a lot, which is why I'm willing to still chair it because you're all good workers. All right. Our next regular meeting will be May 24th. Um, 6.30 if there's no executive session, 6 o'clock if there is, we'll let you know ahead of time about that. Um, and that is tonight's business. We just basically do reorganization at this meeting to keep it short for people, because I know it's a different night and it's one more thing. Right. Anything else anyone has before we adjourn? Um, I don't know if it's on the agenda, if it needs to be right away, but um, we're short a person, correct? on our committee so yeah yes we will um okay we'll open that up um yep there's there's still a three-year seat that is available yes so, so if someone um uh if we appoint a person do we appoint them for the three-year or do is it just the one year i forget what you said jane about if somebody that. is appointed they're only our bylaws say only till the next election. Okay, that's what, there, there are other um, committees that have bylaws that say until the term is up, but ours just say till the next. But thank you, that is a good point. Yeah, till the next okay. election, which is why we ended up with different terms. Okay, 
In that case, I'll entertain a motion to adjourn. Um, did I just hear Sabrina though? Sorry, I don't know if I did, but. Sabrina? You did. I, I was just wondering, and we can talk tomorrow, but for some of the other write-ins, would it be appropriate or inappropriate to connect with them and see if they're willing to serve a year's term? I I don't know. I was going to check and see what the rules are about that. I am right. not familiar enough, but I think that's a good question. Yeah, we um, had, um, I want to say at least seven other write-ins between Gil and Montague. Yes, yeah, there were others and um, just a thought. Yeah, no, I, I think that I think that's an interesting thought. Um, okay, we can touch base tomorrow. Yes, thank you. Um, I'll entertain a motion to adjourn. Move. Second. Her and we'll have a roll call. Heather. Yeah. Bill. Oh, Bill's gone. Bill's Sorry. gone. Yeah. He's napping. Yeah. Jennifer. Yes. Nick. Yes. John. Yes. Timmy. Yes. Me. Yes. If I'm bad enough at this, will somebody else take chair? Is, is that, you know? Nope. <laughs> I'll just continue then to muddle through. That's what you mean. All right. Thank you all. Bye, guys. Have a good evening. Thanks. Sabrina.